Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. In yesterday's video, we did head off with our gang to shoot up some Adriscoll boys, and I have also learned that the game doesn't save at checkpoints, only at the end of missions. So yeah, I had to redo the entire mission up to here, which FYI will explain why my captive here may be a little bit more banged up than in yesterday's video. But we're nearly back to where I left you. Come on. Where are we? Where are we going? Why are we going that way? I want to go this way. Thank you. <laughs> I'm assuming I need to hitch my Here horse. Here we are. Right. You sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. Um. Let's give our horse a little pat. No, no, that not that horse. I want to get back on my horse. Okay, I guess I can't hitch my horse. Oh, there we go. Now we're doing it. I want to pat my horse. Good boy. Uh, it's cold boy. outside. All right. Hold R near my horse to remove Driscoll. Maybe. There we go. Oh, Driscoll. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. No, they're not. <laughs> no, you're not. I can just drop him. Yeah, my horse may have stepped on him. Oops. <laughs> and I may have ridden my horse a little too hard. <laughs> you found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh, no. Now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are going to find out what you need. I can't believe it. An O'Driscoll in my camp. No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister. I, I hate that fella. Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. It is so cold. <laughs> Was that it? Really? I had to go that little bit more and the, and the mission would have been complete. F1. Okay, old friends looking for information on the O'Driscoll's planned train job. Dutch leads the gang into an attack on their camp. Um, I, apparently I did none of these things. I'm not surprised. No, I had to take health items because I just ran out into the open like a idiot. All right, now you guys have said to try and talk to NPCs. Oh, excuse me. You okay, Bill? Are we gonna hit this train then? Seems that way. Okay. Oh. Who is this fellow? Guess that worked out. The old Driscoll's. Now we just have to rob this train. Get out of here. Yeah. Them wagons are still snowed in. Huh. That's Micah. This is Javier. So, how you feeling about this train? I mean, we gotta do something. Yeah, but <laughs> that's more than something. I mean, we gotta do something with our lives, right? So, I think you guys also said that I can save when I'm in between... Player in between, no. Yeah, my stamina went up a whole bunch. I'm like at stamina rank five now or something? No, I'm not. Huh, I thought it said stamina five, but, hmm, my weight is perfect. My dead eye, um, okay, maybe my health went up. I don't know. My horse, my sweet horse. 
Um, story? Save game. All right, why well, saved? <laughs> oh, let's talk to this fellow. Who are you? Lenny. Having fun in here, Lenny? More since we robbed the old Driscolls. <laughs> Hopefully we'll be out of here soon. So, oh, there's my horse. We need a name for you, horse. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, okay, boy. Oh. Okay, I need to go and do this quest here, which is Mr. Pearson needs to speak to you. Am I going to go um, shoot some bow and arrows? Well, let's go in here and, and talk to people. Because why not wander around out in the freezing cold? One other thing. When you get a chance, send someone down the track back to that farmhouse. Okay. Why? That poor woman's husband needs burying. No. Of course. And is it safe down there? Yeah. Oh, just send someone sensible. <laughs> Understood. All right. Good call, Dutch. It's the least we can do for the poor woman. I say Marcus should do it, but that ain't a good idea. The body's in a wagon out front of the house. I'll send someone. Thanks, Jose. So was this Arthur's? Oh, hello, ma'am. How you doing, Molly? So now you're robbing a train. How is that going to help us? I'd speak to Dutch about that. Yeah. I mean, in theory, money, probably. Things to sell to, um, I don't, I don't know. Search my drawer. Or search the drawer. Health cure. Ooh, there's gloves. Should we take the gloves? Apparently we're not taking the gloves. And we're taking Miracle Tonic. More Miracle Tonic. And then close this one. Okay. All right, before we go any further, inventory, tab. Uh, bag. There we go, bag. I wanted to look at my journal again, if I can find it, that is. There we go, there's the journal. Use. Okay. Hmm. So... Harley, the spring I've been hoping for, Jose and I had been planning on a robbery. Yes, we know about that. Oh, does he read it for us? Oh! Well, that makes it a whole lot easier to <laughs> read his cursive writing, which isn't horrible, but, you know, it's tricky at times. Anyone in here? No. Can we go out this way? Is there anyone in here? It's okay. It's okay. Oh, my mistake. You're safe now. She'll be okay, Arthur. I'm sure she will, Mary Beth. Not anytime soon, though, I imagine. There we go. Warm enough, Reverend? More in need of my Keep warm. my medicine. Keep warm. I can't help you Just there. A few more days and we'll get off this hill. I hope so. Stay strong. It's been a nasty few days. I know. And we've had tough times before. We keep moving and we keep together. 
Same as always. All of you. Ain't that so, Mr. Morgan? Yep, totally. Of course. I'm totally listening. <laughs> oh, sorry. Just look after her. So I'll do my best. That he hath Poor woman. Been through a lot. Chooseth the tree that will not rot. He seeketh unto him a country okay, to out. prepare a I think so. Image. Well that done for finding him. Mr. Marston. Some have good news at least. Have ye not yep. heard? Hath it not been this is a strange group of people. Have ye not a reverend with a bunch of outlaws, lots of women, and a child. <laughs> is it he that sitteth upon the circle Just need some of the earth so we can and the get those wagons out? I know. We'll be okay. That stretcheth out the heavens as a curtain and spreadeth them out as a You know a how these things go. Dwelling. We've been through bad times before. The yep. princes to nothing. He maketh the judges of the earth as vanity. You bit happier yay, now, Jack? They shall will we be not okay? be planted. Yeah, yay, so. they shall Just not nice to be rest. sown. Yay, I think he keeps saying sorry because I keep stepping on people. In the earth, and <laughs> Which, you know, my bad. Them, and they shall wither, Uncle? And the All quiet here while we were gone? I think so. I slept for most of it. To Typical. <laughs> Like in me, or shall I be equal? Sayeth the Holy One. You okay, Abigail? Yeah. And behold, how do you boys get on with old Driscoll's? It's dealt with for now, anyway. How's um? <sighs> you doing okay now? Ah, I think so. Thank you. Of course. Jacob, and speak Israel. My All right. way is hid from the Lord, and my judgment is okay. passed over Let's go. from God. Back outside into the frozen tundra. Okay, I'm just saying we should chop down some of these houses and use wood. But maybe it's too damp or something. I mean, like, I'm going to pretend like I know what I'm talking about because I don't. <laughs> okay. Let's go over here into this building area the guy I need to talk to is there so let's not go there right away let's instead can we go in here oh, I can't why is my horse not in here they'll come looking for me you know well maybe they'll come looking for those old Driscoll boys we killed at that ranch down the way who is that Declan fat Tommy we didn't get as far as introduction Oh, oh, God. I'm standing on the chair because the horses are pooping everywhere. Ugh. Hello, Charles. You okay in here, Charles? It's all right, considering. Well, try to rest that hand. What did you do to your hand? Can we talk to the prisoner here? You got lucky. We kept you alive. I'd rather be dead. Patience, my friend. <laughs> Patience. Yeah, don't don't ask for, you know, any of that. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna sit. Okay, let's head back on out here. And then since I've done all sorts of chatting, I'm gonna save. Okay, now let's go talk to Pearson? P? I think P was for Pearson. Cause <coughs> <laughs> I just jump up on tables. starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. Holding this to focus and use internet options. Okay, R. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. <laughs> we were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. <laughs> when we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. 
Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted awful. Uh. Starving will be preferable. Kind Come of. On, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. <coughs> Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. Oh, yeah. You're never yeah. too old to learn, I imagine. <laughs> and he sort right. of shade it. Let's head out. <laughs> How old Arthur is? Assorted salted awful. <laughs> oh, yuck. Let's let's look at it anyway. Ingredients. No, where's the food? Here it is. Assorted salted awful. Mm -mm. I know what awful is, and I've never had it, but I can't say I'm inclined to try. <laughs> How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. I uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill? It ain't no dress. Watch out! Uh, Sorry. Careful. Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way, find some higher ground. Whew. Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, going out for John, that thing with the O'Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. Mm -hmm. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that, just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. <sighs> well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. Yeah, I, I would like to know what happened too. Maybe we can have like a flashback sequence to kind of explain it to me. That'd be, that'd be amazing. I love these cinematic writing sequences. It's really pretty. You can just enjoy the atmosphere. Okay, nothing to say. There's some patches of grass here. This is good. Let's look down this way. died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now shh, stay quiet. Yeah, Arthur, stay quiet. We're hunting for rabbits. <laughs> hey, stop here a second. I see something. What do you see? We probably need our, our, our bow and arrow, right? Have deer been here recently? Ah. How can you tell? How can you not? We'll track them on foot. Shh. You're going to need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. A gun okay. will scare everything around. All right. You need to calm your horse down, sir. See, I'll give him a good pet. Good boy. Come on. Grab that bow off the horse. There you go. Um, this one maybe? 
bow. Quiet as you can. Stay low and move slowly. Be very, very quiet. We're hunting for rabbits, right? You see the tracks? Uh, I think so. Maybe not. Focus. Uh huh. It's easier in the snow, but once you get dry, you'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. Why? Why are we? There we go. Your scent is also shown in eagle eye, blowing in the direction of the wind. Animals will flee if they smell your scent, so remain downwind or far away when hunting. Oh my gosh, there are so many things. I'm gonna be. <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. see it unknown animal well Charles says it's a deer ah, there it is there it is I see it wait look there they are quick get that bow out Arthur try to hit him in the neck or head Quick and clean. Get good. Nice. See if you can get another one. Hunt another deer. Okay. Attract animal's attention by selecting call while aiming at it. This will give you a chance of a clean kill as they raise their head before fleeing. Uh, or I could just, you know, shoot it. Okay, it's over there. I see it now. He is way too far away. Isn't he? I got him! Oh no, I didn't get him. I missed him. Go finish it off. Ah, I'm no good at running deer. Oh, that's well done. I think that's all we can carry. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hand's okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Come on, we should really be getting back. Pick up deer, okay. okay. I'll go grab the other one. I'm, I'm sorry, Mr. Deer, that I'm, I'm so bad at... <whistles> Compendium updates, F1. What's that? White-tailed deer. Total progress, 50%. I've tracked and killed two. White-tailed deer are found in a variety of habitats across the states, but are common to the forests of New Hanover, Lemoyne, and West Elizabeth. Their herbivorous diet includes grasses, nuts, fungi, twigs, and fruit. Keep your distance when hunting deer can increase your chances of a kill as they are easily startled. Long-range weapons such as rifle or a bow with poison arrows are considered to be the best when hunting. Okay, question. If you shoot an animal with poisoned arrow and it goes into their blood system, when you cook it, won't you technically be 
um, poisoning yourself or when you cook it, does the poison dis disapparate or whatever that word is? I am just, just a wonder. Uh, deer hide can be used for crafting and the venison meat can be used for cooking. That, that, yes, I would imagine. Oh, how many do I have to 50%? Do I get something when I get to be a hundred percent? Oh my gosh. There are so many page one of 12. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. This game, this game is huge. Equipment. Oh, I have a lasso. Binoculars and a lantern. Page one of four. Oh my God, it's very stressful. <laughs> There's so many things. Oh, Driscoll boys. After finding success in competing for scores with Dutch's gang out in the West, the O'Driscoll boys headed to the Plains of Valentine. The gang are known for enrolling new members that are considered to be disposable. The O'Driscoll boys are renowned for the easy money schemes, which often consist of robbing banks, looking for a fun time, and their love of horrors. I've killed 34 of them. Total progress is 11%. Okay. Any? I've got some more gangs to discover. I'm apparently going to go fishing, I would imagine. Oh, I've got one of 144. <laughs> Wait, there was, here we go. Flora of America. Yeah, Carolina Lupine. There are so many, oh, I may have to limit what I actually do. Or I could be playing this game for like three years. Like, let's be honest with how slow I am. But I'm 3% complete now. <laughs> your horse will respond to your calls as long as it is in range. Continue to bond with your horse to increase the distance at which it responds to your whistling. Where, where might my horse be? My horse is over there. I hear my horse coming. Hello, horsey. I need to find a name for you. I gotta think of one. Oof, this deer looks extremely heavy. Good. good boy. You came when I called. Good job. You're all right, boy. I'm getting a plus horse on the right hand side of my screen every time I do that, so. Okay, boy. <laughs> I have to meet up with Charles, who's. Just look for the right yellow dot. There he is. Ready to head back when you are. Come on, then. Let's head back. Animal carcasses can be dropped off at to Pearson to nice contribute work, to Arthur. gang supplies. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found them. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. Yeah. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Yeah. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. Mm -hmm. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. <laughs> Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. 
We ain't feeding Neil Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful person right? was kind enough to give us. <laughs> the girl, she has a wild look in her eye. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. Yeah. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Yeah, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Nah, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big guy, nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Cole, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. Okay. I must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Okay, hang on. I'm gonna pause here. Because <laughs> that the bear fight looks like that could go on for a bit. I feel like I'm gonna have to kill a bear and I'm gonna be really bad at it. But but we'll find out tomorrow because like I said, I'm pausing here today. So in tomorrow, maybe we will wrap up this mission. I would like to 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 move on to um it seems like we're going to do a train robbery, so I'd like to see how that goes. Probably not well. <laughs> but anyway, we'll find out soon enough, I'm sure. But anyways, as always, thank you so very much for watching. Please do keep yourselves safe, and I will see you again tomorrow with another new Red Dead Redemption 2 video.